The case curriculum is designed and based off an activities, projects, and problem model. We're trying to teach the students how to think. We want them to be self-directed learners. We're building the students' knowledge, and then we give them an opportunity in a project or problem to uh, take that knowledge and then apply it to a real-world situation. Case does have some challenges. It, it really does force the student to be independent, and you must think for yourself, but at the end of the day, it really helps you to get a better grasp of the concepts. I enjoy coming to the class where I participate in CASE because it's like a fresh awakening from all of your other classes where you're just handed information on a PowerPoint, expected to write it down, memorize it long enough to take the test and move on to the next subject. During CASE, you actually learn what you're working on and how you're going to apply it to real life. CASE does a lot of support for agriculture teachers, so teachers are actually trained to be able to deliver the curriculum. I wanted the national science standards so that I could align my curriculum with them. CASE has already done that. Every single science standard that we touch upon is already aligned. Every lesson that I teach is already has every science standard in, along with the math and English standards. CASE has really helped me throughout my other classes by with science, like molecular biology, kind of goes into CASE because we're learning about animals through their reproductive and like cells. The dissecting pig lab, we're basically looking at body structures, basically taking a look at the, the physical uh, makeup of those fetal pigs. They've been injected with dye so the students can see the veins and the uh, arteries. We use our math skills like our algebra and our geometry. We're doing um, equations to figure out different things. Uh, everybody should have your swabs. You'll see some students that do a, a biosecurity uh, lab and one of the things that we're doing is we're streaking petri dishes uh, so that we can see what bacteria might be able to grow and the students actually take the scenarios of uh, what would happen if you had a biosecurity issue on a farm. I'm doing an osmosis lab and we're actually going to be testing how quickly it happens along with what types of materials go into other substances. This lab applies to agriculture because you need to know how water passes through the soil in the fields and how certain pesticides will go through certain plants in the soils as well. We've done labs that involve livestock. We've talked about safety for livestock, like how do you take care of them and what is the um, way to take care of them, like to keep them healthy and to keep them safe. Innovation is very important to companies like Cargill. CASE very much helps those students as they prepare for those future jobs, be good thinkers. And when those jobs are ready for the students, the students are ready for the jobs. I'm really looking forward to becoming a vet, and these labs really help me get a feel for what I'll be doing for the rest of my life. To the Team Ag Ed and CASE supporters, I say thank you for supporting the CASE curriculum. Thank you for creating this program because it has actually changed my life and what I want to do with my future. Thank you to the Team Ag Ed and Case supporters for everything that you have done, bringing Case through our agriculture education, and you have inspired me to teach other kids about Case in the future and to continue to grow agriculture education.